IPMNation.com. I'm Steve. And I'm Morris. And, and we're, we're the, the Crunchy Western, Western Boys, Boys on Local Outbreak. <laughs> Welcome Outbreak on IPM Nation and 100.1 The Planet. This is Matt from IPM Nation. We are here at the studio at 50 Canal Street in downtown Laconia, though it won't be at 50 Canal Street for much longer. It's almost time for the big move, but when you hear this, it'll still be at 50 Canal Street. So come on down, say hello to Melissa before she moves around the corner up the street to a much better location. But, uh, of course, you can find it online. The StudioNH.com is the website. Don't forget our other sponsors, of course, Tweak Sound and Mastering at TweakSound.com. And Central NH Events, if you need a DJ for your event, go to CentralNHEvents.com. Tim Martin does a great job. And, of course, uh, Sonic Wallpaper, Ryan LeMay, uh, providing music lessons for uh, people who uh, couldn't otherwise afford them. And, of course, uh, Inspire Music. We're doing our uh, continuing our series with them the last Saturday of every month at Inspire Music in Franklin, New Hampshire. Uh, the Tim and Dave Show is the next one for the end of this month, so looking forward to that. And we have with us here tonight, we have Steve and Morris from the Country Western Boys. Crunchy. What did I say? Country. Did I say country? You did. I meant to say <laughs> I meant to say crunchy. Everybody does. Everybody does. They either say country or they say crunchy mountain boys, which is a mystery to me. I don't understand that. Because that's just making it up. Yeah. Or, sorry about that. That's no, okay. <laughs> I can bleep it. I didn't know. I was going to say, is there a band called Country Mountain Boys? Nope. That's weird then. Yep. Okay. Well, we learned something. Yeah. Or some, or we learned not something <laughs> in, a, in a sense. But you guys are um, now, and you guys are going to play live for us tonight, which is great. And uh, we were kind of talking off air. Uh, Morris and I were talking about, I guess these are all brand new tunes. Mm. Well, yeah, yeah. So the, this is a world them. premiere. Yeah, none of them are world on, radio on premiere. the existing records. Yeah, we we like the world premieres here at uh, Local Outbreak. Yeah, so <laughs> not many people have heard him. And tonight's uh, a first because it's uh, we've never had a stand up bass on the on the show, or a couple stand up guys like us. Oh, you beat me to it by oh. a second. <laughs> you beat you to it. So uh, Aren't well, you glad I got the mic. <laughs> See, he was worried that I wouldn't say anything. Why don't we um we'll, well since you guys are all set up, why don't we hear something and then we'll uh come back and we'll we'll chat. What do you guys want to play to open the show? A song called My Ruin, which is a true story about my ruin. Your oh okay. I, I was there, I saw it. Oh my goodness. Yeah. All right. Yeah, these circles under my well look, look my glasses <laughs> don't there you go, see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The folks at home couldn't see that, but Right. I just But I saw them. You saw them. And that's yeah. what counts. The dark circles. It's uh, theater of the mind. <laughs> <laughs> All right, great. So the guys are going to perform for us live here tonight. My oh, ruin. Dark Thirty circles. The crunchy <laughs> Western boys here on local outbreak on IPM Nation and one hundred point one The Planet. Ready? Two, three. Girls I like, like their cocktails They like the smoke, they like the touch The girls I like, it just seems like I like them way too much And I can see you're such a bad girl You undoubtedly do delight Won't you contribute to my ruin? Take me home tonight You'll be a boon to my bad habits I know you kick me when I'm down You steal the money from my tip jar 
Then you invite me on the town Your major test to my composure You always itching for a fight Won't you contribute to my ruin And take me home tonight You always looking for a key change In the middle of my song You always messing with my arrangements It's modulations all night long But you've a fascinating rhythm You keep your rhythm section tight Won't you contribute to my ruin Take me home Organized religion Don't believe I care for professional sports I don't believe that time is money Or that there's justice in our courts But I believe you could be my downfall And if I'm going down, let's do it right Won't you contribute to my ruin? Take me home tonight Won't you contribute to my ruin And take me home tonight IPMNation.com Local outbreak on IPM Nation and 100.1 The Planet. This is Matt from IPM Nation. We are here tonight with the crunchy Western boys. <laughs> I remember the R that time. So we got uh, Steve and Morris here, and um, and they're playing for us live tonight. But um, so now I have a question. So on the on the Facebook page, yeah. and actually on the back of one of the CDs because you brought a couple of discs with you. It's four guys. But is it is it really just you guys are kind of the the core of the band or? Is it the, the two the, of you most of the time? There's two of us, and then we have a fiddle player uh, by the name of Jacob Stern who, okay. who plays with us and has played with us for a, a long time. Millennium. Millennia, even. Wow, that is a yeah, long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. He looks pretty good, though, you know? Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> at least on the radio. Yeah. Uh, and, uh, um, and he sounds good tonight. Yeah, yeah he sounds great tonight. Um <laughs> He blends right in. It's almost yeah. like he's yeah. not here. It's yes. weird. Yes. Uh, it's a very airy sound. Yes, yeah. deep very, in the mix. Very, yeah, but uh, we <laughs> used to have we used to, we've gone through some mandolin players of late. Um, we parted ways with one and had another one lined up, and then he, you know, he fell in love. Fell in love. And off he went, and then we found another one. We have other ways of saying that that are appropriate for the listening. Right, uh, we, and yes. we had a genuine, a genuine um, uh, South Carolinian for a while, and he's yeah. a great player, a really nice guy. Uh, but his he's wife back in South Carolina, yeah, his, his oh. wife had a baby, and they moved back to be near his people. And, okay, uh, and so a lot of sex involved with our mandolin players. You know, which is weird because hmm. well, actually, it, it 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 explains the lack thereof for the rest of the members. The mandolin yeah. players just kind of take it all. Yeah, yeah. that's yeah. not. They're not the fair. drummer, you know, like the drummer in a rock band. Right, right, right. And, then, right. You know, the and band, the rest of us are all just the bass player. <laughs> <laughs> So so let, let's let's throw that out there. Anybody yeah. who's uh, interested in playing mandolin in a band that you know actually works and and makes some money, yeah. um, as opposed to five different bands that don't, right? Uh, yes. We're we're open. Yeah, yeah. we we've, we've tried some people out, and it, it's we mostly bumped into guitar players that have seen or have touched in a mandolin at one point in their right. life, as opposed to a mandolin player who plays guitar too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A vocal is a must also. And a vocal is a must. A, yeah. And a third vocal harmony would be really sweet. So I can imagine that would be pretty difficult 
to, to find. I mean, I didn't. Yeah, yeah we didn't. really. We yeah. had no idea. I didn't. Yeah. Well, and because when we first when we first swapped, we had someone right there re- waiting in the wings. You know? Okay. And, yeah. And they they did the classic thing from the I'm your guy. I don't care. <laughs> you know, it doesn't matter if it's work or whatever, right. man. I'm like committed. Yeah. And then like two months later, it's like, yeah, I don't think I can play with you anymore. Ugh. Why? I think I'm in love and I'm moving away. <laughs> Wow! After was it really after two months? It, 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 oh, it, it, not much more. Than not that. much more than really? we had to threaten him just to stick with us through the end of the summer to fill all the gigs we had lined up. Yeah, yeah. And oh wow! It was a bummer, and because yeah. he was a, was a nice guy and he had a great vocal blend that worked really well with what we were doing. He was the guy we wanted to have. It yeah. turned out that love is a mini splintered thing. Mm-hmm. Splintered thing. Yes. Yeah. I'm still picking them out of places. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> <laughs> but it but, says the only married guy still in the band. <laughs> Maybe not after this. Mm. Um, so uh, has it always been uh, the two of you though have always been in the band? It's uh, is it has it been the two of you? No, actually I was no? a replacement bass player. Oh, but, no kidding. But he and I have played together in several we've we've been playing on and off t- with each other for 20 some odd years. Oh, no Say kidding. it that way. All right. Yeah, I noticed that too. That's yeah, a little, that was a little yeah. creepy. Yeah. yeah. Now, there's anything wrong with that? No, <laughs> not that he knew it. I've been just following him around and looking in his bedroom. He waits till I fall asleep. 20, yeah. yeah. Fanboying him. Play yeah. with me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I detune his guitar. <laughs> I think I'm the I'm the last uh, surviving original member of the Crunchy Western Boys. Okay. Wow. If you can call this surviving, but yeah. Yeah. So uh, how long has uh, the band technically existed then? So obviously more than twenty years, right? If oh no no no, but oh no what? Oh you guys oh that's right you guys have been playing together twenty years yeah okay. we we played together in a first band we played together in is a band called the Regular Einsteins which lasted okay. for I don't know four years or oh. five years and then but it felt like forty uh yeah, yeah yeah well it's like the old saying you know you know you'll you'll live longer if you stop smoking it's like well it, at least it'll seem longer right. <laughs> 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 um uh yeah so and then we were in another band after that and then our drummer left that band and so that sort of fell apart because we couldn't find another drummer the yeah like mandolin players on the ground up here yeah and uh then he ended up playing with these guys and when their bass player left i got tapped and but that's like five years ago now okay at least, at least yeah maybe so, longer yeah, so, you, so, so you've been there since close to the beginning, then, really, it sounds like. Yeah. I came in, I, I, I didn't play on the first disc, but I sang a lot of the backup vocals. Now, which one's the first one? That the self-titled, right I assume? Yeah. yeah. And um, because I just remember Morris calling me. He's like, well, I can either take a couple weeks to teach these guys to sing what you already know how to sing, or you can come up for the afternoon, and I'll get you drunk, and we'll play some songs, and you can sing some vocals. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did I say it that way? Pretty much, yeah, Sounds and like and that's it. Huh. it was it was that was a self fulfilling prophecy. And, yeah, and we did sing, we did get drunk. Yeah, yeah, um, and then yeah, not not, not in that order. Yeah, not long, not <laughs> long after that, I was in the band. So, okay, okay. Uh, so yeah. I am on the second one. Okay, like on bass and everything else. Yeah, yeah. So um, we were talking to off air, and um, you guys were talking about like playing at True Brew. Mm. And and filling a whole night with original music. How many songs do you guys have? We original? just we just did a list. We have about what forty. That's incredible. Really? Yeah, that are in kind of in that the that we can rotation. actually play. Wow. He's, yeah. He's got Morris has more. Really? Yeah. Like lots more that yeah. aren't appropriate for like this or better as a rock band kind of thing. Or, yeah. yeah. Closer. Yeah, or more yeah. jazzy. Oh, okay. Um, yeah. But don't, yeah, don't yeah, that. no, and even that no string band. No, no, no jazz, jazz chords. No jazz. I don't want any of this stuff. <laughs> we, those, we just played that chord. <laughs> well, I sneak them in, but yeah, nobody's anyway. looking. Right, but they can't right. see us on radio. Right, so but, that's uh, right. <laughs> I mean, even our regular shows, our regular Crunchy Western Boys shows, tend to be. I don't know what about seventy percent original music, At least, yeah. yeah. And then we we throw in a few covers to keep people like you know you see them drifting. But the covers go or the originals go over well. Yeah, um, we get away with it. No one's yeah. going, you know, you, you know. And we throw them wagon wheel every now and again. And yeah, hold our nose and play it. 
<laughs> um, it's a good song, but it's a know. lovely song. Yeah. Well, I haven't run into anybody around here who really sounds like you guys. You know, I mean, who would want to? <laughs> <laughs> well, you see how well it's working for us, <laughs> right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I don't know. See, now you're going to get the local outbreak bump. So, you know. No, we noticed it. We drove up whatever that street is over there before we turned on this one, and it yeah. was like uh, mandolin players scattered. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like, like cockroaches yeah. when you turn the light on? Yeah. 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 Right, right. <laughs> Actually, that's what happens no. when they turn the light on the stage when we're playing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you guys sound great, the two of you. And the, oh, the, thanks. The vocals thanks. sound nice and full, and, and uh, no, it sounds really good. Um, and there's no, uh, I haven't heard the, the studio tracks yet. There's no drums, I assume you guys. No, 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 no. We, we, on the studio thing, it's kept to basically four piece. There's, there's yeah. some random, I think there's a little, not that you'd ever notice. If I tell you there's a little percussion on there, yeah. you'll go looking for it. I dare you to find it. Really? Yeah. 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 It's the, the, but nothing, nothing major. There's no kit playing on there at all. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Well, why don't we um, let's hear another song? What do you guys want to play next? Uh, <laughs> what the hell are we gonna play? Uh, <laughs> we're gonna play. Uh, uh, we're gonna play. Um, uh, uh, straight to blue. Oh, straight, straight to blue. That's a new yes. one. That's, yeah. that's, I don't think anybody's really heard that. No, that's. One. I think. Uh, yeah, that's a that's a so, brand a new song. We've never that we played that out. To play. uh, so. We've dragged out drug out there in front of people <laughs> we've done it we can talk with SS Your tonight so it sounds like more come up from the northern new hampshire there, there, right? yeah, it's <laughs> sounds good to me too so Steve. I, I do kind of blue right now it's, 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 it's straight yes. blue kind of whatever uh, you ready whatever i uh, yeah, yeah, can count it off there boys <laughs> <laughs> okay let's do that what is it guys d right d is the weird thing in the middle yeah so just start like that, huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, yabba dabba do. My man in the middle, is it black or is it white? Am I your second fiddle? Am I your shadow or your light? There's a spectrum of two colors and I see most every hue But when it comes to you, look straight to blue Is it a debit or a credit in the black or in the red? Doesn't matter much who said it, only just that it got said The pink skies in the morning where they should have warned me to but when it comes to you, love straight to blue Now it's three o'clock in the morning And you're with another man I'm trying to be graceful I'm trying to understand But you've had this conversation A million times or more And it's looking like my blue skies will be Humor and bad habits Now they're all I've got to show For all the greens of jealousies And the reds of afterglow Now you tell me that you love me You might even think it's true When it comes to you Look straight to blue Man, I'm trying to be graceful, trying to understand that you've had this conversation a million times before. Been looking like my blue skies will be bluer than before. Like humor and bad habits, now they're all I've got to show. All the greens of jealousies and the reds of afterglow. Now I ask me that you love me. You might even think it's true When it comes to you Look straight to blue Yeah, you tell me that you love me You might even think it's true When it comes to you Look straight to blue
sorry. I was gonna. I did it. I did it. IPMNation.com. Look, loud break on IPM Nation and 100.1 The Planet, and this is Matt from IPM Nation sitting here at the studio with the guys from the Country Western Boys. Uh, you did I it did again. it again. The <laughs> Crunchy Western Boys. Crunchy. Crunchy. <laughs> We're in BC. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes. Um, that's that's a good good Howard reference there. Thanks. Um, <laughs> not everyone will get it, but uh, but the ones that do will like it. Um, so where does the name come from, Crunchy Western Boys? Um, you want to tell the story? I, I, you were more there than I was. Yeah. <clears throat> the two original guys are where the name came from was a, a this guy Jim McHugh and his friend uh, Wayne. Wayne would host an open mic night up at the uh, Sunset Grill up in Campton. Okay. That's New Hampshire for you folks playing the home game. <laughs> and uh, the bartender there, who is a, a classic character, hey, Jesse, um, decided that because the one guy, they, they called him Country Wayne because he played uh, Merle Haggard songs and yeah. George Jones. And then Jim played mostly like Grateful Dead and Grateful and Dead. Wore and, like tie dyes. And oh, stuff. really? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so it became Crunchy Jim Crunchy and Western Jim Wayne. And Western oh, Wayne. okay, okay. And then it became the Crunchy Western Boys. Oh, okay. Yeah. And then we've yeah been stuck with that name ever since. Yeah, yeah. no, no it's a good name. For better or worse, the, it's the kind of name where you know you can feel pretty safe that you're not going to get a cease and desist letter from somebody who's like, "Hey, that's that's our name. We own it." You know, no, it's but the original. Uh, Apparently, we've it's proven it's hard memorable. to pronounce. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. That's true. Is it ever? Does it ever um, get misspelled on a flyer or a All sign? The time. Or anything? Really? Yeah, yeah, it's it's those two things. It, yeah. it either either people get the get it get country western or they do crunchy mountain. I don't understand that. Yeah, the but crunchy mountain thing is weird. No, you're making things up out of whole cloth at that point. <laughs> I don't understand that. But whatever. Yeah, whatever. yeah. As long as they, you know, call me what you want. Just call me. Right. Maybe. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> you guys play a lot, right? You do a lot of shows. Yep, Morris was saying earlier off air about about summertime being really busy for you guys. Yep, yep, we're we're usually pretty busy. We last bunch of years we've done the um, we've played the the Flying Monkey um, for their what their anniversary show for oh. a couple of times. They're headlined their bluegrass blowout thing a couple of times. Yeah, we've done one show there by ourselves with an opener. We've done a couple of opening acts. We got to. Actually, the, the the most fun opening act we did was we opened for the Nitty Gritty Dirt Band. Oh, yeah? And it was really cool because the guys, we ended up hanging out with Jim McEwen, who's the banjo player in the band. He hung out in our dressing room the whole time before we hit the stage. Oh, no kidding. Yeah, Jim McEwen's our ex- McEwen, isn't oh. it? Yeah. John, John. John McEwen. There you go. We Sorry. don't want to get these things wrong. Um, <laughs> and uh, uh, they all came out and watched our set. Yeah. And so when we got done, we went away, and uh, Jacob, our fiddle player, came running up, and he goes, they want us to come do something with them at the end of the night. So we ended up getting to go on stage, and we did the wait. Um, I got to sing a verse with, with the, the, the Nitty Gritty Dirt oh, no I got kidding. to do a verse of the wait. Oh, that's and cool. then all of us did May the Circle Be Unbroken with them. As oh, the no big kidding. It was, like, it was really nice of them. They were oh, super, wow. super nice and cool. Oh, that's you, cool. You, you don't... You do those opening act things, and you usually don't even get to meet the guys. Right, Never right. Mind oh them yeah, being cool. You oh know? yeah. <clears throat> so that that was really fun. That was a good. Well, night. we got yeah. we got up on stage and did all that, but afterwards they said, "No, no, that's not what we meant." <laughs> 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 yeah. We needed help. We got a bad tire on the bus, and uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <we did>. yeah. <laughs> no, that's the circle we were talking about, and it is broken. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, these misunderstandings happen, you know. <laughs> what do you what do you guys uh I mean do you guys <clears throat> classify yourselves as bluegrass is that no, no. what no I, I always say we're the, we're the band that if you're a big bluegrass fan you'll go you guys aren't bluegrass right and if you're not a bluegrass <laughs> fan you'll go oh that they're they're a bluegrass band right you know? right and, and so I don't know what we, what what you'd call us yeah Americana that yeah seems yeah, to be yeah. the big that's kind of all I was gonna say catch all for for stuff and yeah we're, uh, we play Appalachian Swing. Mm. Mm. There you go, Appalachian <laughs> Swing. And we want to just point out that it's still Appalachia, even though it's New Hampshire. 
Right. Actually, we'd like to point out that this is New Hampshire. For all those people down in Portsmouth, this is still New Hampshire. In fact, most of New Hampshire happens north of Portsmouth. Just, just, just the little, little, uh, you know, uh, uh, like notice. What do you call those? Uh, uh, I can't, can't. I'm having aphasia. Uh, a a uh, pro tip? Uh, no, no, no. Like a. Uh, this is a, a memo. A uh, the, public service public announcement. Public service announcement. Oh, okay. PSI. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was going for. A little PSI. There is more New Hampshire above Concord, ladies and gentlemen. It could be per PSA. Sure. No, per square inch. Plus, it'd be announcement. Yeah. What have we done? <laughs> what have we done? Wait, I've, I've, I'm sorry. I've, I've started to get angry <laughs> in southern New Hampshire. I know. <laughs> why is that? What is this? Why, why do you have so much rage for southern New Hampshire? I don't have any rage for southern <laughs> New Hampshire. We actually we, seen rage. We, we do. They just, they <laughs> just do. tend to make a lot of voting decisions that that, that aren't well thought out for ah. those of us who live up north. Okay. Okay. And. Uh, New Hampshire really starts at exit 32 on, on Route 93. Um, I was going to go with 23. Stuff. I think you just got that a little backwards. Yeah, okay. I gave up. I gave up on the, <laughs> the lakes region. Really? You, you've, you've burned my, ne- my neck of the woods, yeah. too? <laughs> yeah. That'd be a great state motto, New Hampshire. It starts at exit 23. Yeah, yeah. Or 32. Right. Yeah, right. <laughs> the, big, the big hand doing a particular symbol. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That'd be great. They make a great T-shirt. Yes, it? yes. I'm copyrighted that right now. So, who needs the man on the mountain? You got that. There will no one anymore. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's there. true. That's true. They took yeah. care of that too, didn't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> In the middle of the night, gone. they just stole it. Which it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> So where do you guys play? Oh, you guys man's out of here. Well, speaking of, do you guys tour around? We, we we do a few gigs every summer. We do like, receptions, conceptions, brisses, if we have to. No, you know the tips are great. <laughs> oh, oh, oh wow! <laughs> oh god! Sorry, that I'm gonna have to add it in a rim try, shot. Try, yeah, exactly. try the veal. We'll be here all week. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, no, we're we're down at the Gaslight in Portsmouth this year. The summer, interview took 15 times. minutes. The editing took three days. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here's the second portion of our show. <laughs> uh, now, you've only given me one thing I have to bleep so far. So. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah. No, you're not trying hard. Uh, I know. It made me want to, like, just let loose. <laughs> mm. Well, there's the online version, which is... Uh, there you go. Yeah. There you go. We'll do the podcast version. We can be as horrible as we want to be. <laughs> do you guys get out of New Hampshire to, to, to tour, or do you? Uh... We haven't been out for a little while. We we have. We've been. Uh, uh, I wasn't in the band at the time, but y'all went to Ireland a couple, three times. Really? Yeah. Uh, um, we've been West Coast, Oregon, Virgin a couple Islands. of times. Virgin Islands. Yeah. Um, Nashville, Tennessee. Nashville, Tennessee. <laughs> we were out there in uh, out chair. What out chair in those flyover states? Was it Indiana? <laughs> That's one of them. Yes, we did. <laughs> That's one of them. We were out there for the John Hartford Fest two summers ago. Oh. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, we get out out and about. Mm. Um, you wouldn't know it the way we act, but right, right, it's, no, it's true. <laughs> no, it's amazing. My wife lets me out of the house, especially with you, Morris. <laughs> She's thankful you're out of the house. Yeah. There you go. There you go. So, what what is your is some of your busiest time as far as shows? Or yeah, yeah, yeah. we we're we're like oftentimes you know five days a week or or, or more. more. Wow, good for you. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah, you guys yeah. are doing well then. That's it is. Great. It's good. And, and you know. Well, we're we're kind of like the Huns when we visit. You know, we just. Take... I like to go with the hot and tots myself. Oh, the hot and yeah. tots. <laughs> yeah, well, just for that line in, in uh, The Wizard of Oz with the lion. You know, what makes the hot and tots so hot? The courage. <laughs> wow. See, I wouldn't have even gotten that reference if you. I mean, I, wow, I haven't seen The Wizard of Oz in so long. What's wrong with you, dude? It's been like years, like decades. You've been living in a black and white world, man. I have. <laughs> Do they still show it every year on network TV? They I don't still... think so. But do you remember when that was a big deal? You remember that growing up? That's like a huge deal. That, that and The Sound of Music. Those two movies, for some reason, they would show every year, once a year on NBC, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Maybe they do. They might still do that. That's I weird. I don't know. Yeah. So um, and where do you guys record? Because you've got... I, do is it as far as studio albums so far? Is it just these two? Just or? the two. We're we're yeah. overdue for a third. In fact, we have like we were just saying. You know, we probably have at least a double album worth of stuff. Wow. Stored yeah. Up. Um, 
No, we've been we were going to record last Friday, but Morris or Saturday, and then Morris like died. Yes, I was very ill. He was very mm-hmm. ill. Yeah. So we had to cancel a gig and everything. <laughs> oh and wow! I had thought about recording today, but we're doing this. Right. Yeah. I actually did yes. too. I was like, and "Hey, in, we don't have a gig this Tuesday. Let's go record." And oh in yeah. Way we are recording something. Yeah, that's so, true. I had that's to, true. I had to convince him. Yeah. So where where are you recording? Where have you been? Uh... We record at home. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> the the last two albums were done in Morris's back uh, son's old bedroom. Okay. Cool. Yep. What do you what do you record on for the recording geeks out there? What do you use for like a program? Uh, uh Logic. Uh, okay. Apple. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Although the first no, actually two the weren't f- recorded. No, on the first Apple one Logic. was done with the uh, uh, Roland workstation. Oh, okay. Which uh, I actually really liked working with. Yeah. But everything, you know, it all becomes obsolete. So oh fast. yeah, I know it does. And, uh, it does. Rather like I don't know. You. <laughs> yes. Just like oh me. Oh, my. And then, and then you, right close behind me. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, I'm catching up. I'm constantly, I'm, I'm, I'm drafting you. <laughs> and, and occasionally, I still, I have a, a reel-to-reel machine. Like a, Do you? That, nice. Uh, I keep thinking maybe that's just what we should do because most of it's just this you know yeah yeah if yeah. we can get a good a good basic track down with bass and, and a mandolin and, and player with a vocal but, yeah yeah not not to bring that up again yeah get a nice warm sound i would think with a reel to reel yeah there, there are warm tears on my cheeks just talking about it well there you go and my again theater of, theater that, of that was that theater was me of the just, mind that was me just <laughs> lovingly dabbing his tears away with a linen napkin yes <laughs> yes Wow, that was what that sounded. Yeah, it was making your blackface streak. <laughs> <Jeez>. <laughs> well, let's hear another song. Excuse me. <laughs> what, do you, what do you guys want? We're naked too, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, no. I mean, they're, they're, well, okay. The audience okay. knows that you're we, not, but we, we Morris and right. I are. Well, yeah. I, I I do insist that all of our guests be nude. And no, we I, it's we nice knew that. that you guys. Uh, yeah, we knew that nice. going in. Yeah. 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 Well, you know, we do have radio bodies. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's right. Uh, <laughs> wow. Uh, okay. Right. Well, uh, what are we going to play? <laughs> uh, I think this is uh, two this, cars, right? This is another true story. Yes. Right. This is a. Uh, uh, well, you could look at it as a metaphor, but really, it's just about <laughs> two cars that won't start. It's a good wintertime song. Yeah. Uh, the names have been changed to protect the amorous to protect my Volvos. Although I do have, I have a 740 uh, wagon for sale. It's probably a parts car at this point, but yeah. I really like to, you know anybody in the market. So this song we'll is, trade it for a This song player. is really a. Uh, <laughs> there, you go. there you go. This is really a Craigslist anthem. Is okay. What it is, so. <laughs> All right. Two Shall cars. We carry on. <laughs> I like this one. I heard it during sound check. I like this one a lot. All right. Here it is. Okay. All right. One, two, three. Two cars that won't start. Dead in the driveway. Looking for the right parts. To send us on our way. Call up the click and clack. Call up the triple A. Cars that won't start dead in the driveway. I was down at the AA meeting trying to get my license back. Went up pulled certain trouble in a Subaru out back. She said, I swear I've seen ya somewhere. So, sweetie, tell me what you think. We could broaden your horizons and you could buy this broader drink. Two cars, it won't start. Dead in the driveway. Looking for the right parts to send us on our way. Call up the click and clack. Call up the triple A. Cars that won't start dead in the driveway.
looking for the right parts to send us on our way. Call up the click and clack. Call up the triple A. Two cars that won't start. Dead in the driveway. Two cars that won't start. Dead in the driveway. IPMNation.com Welcome to Outbreak on IPM Nation and 100.1 The Planet. This is Matt from IPM Nation. We're here at the studio at 50 Canal Street in downtown Laconia. I think this is actually... No, it's not... Yeah, no, I think this is our last show here before Melissa moves to the to the new location. But uh, you can find out where that is online at uh, thestudionh.com. And uh, tonight we got uh, the guys from the crunchy Western Boys... <laughs> and uh a big studio audience here where should uh where should people go online to keep up with everything you guys are doing uh, uh probably to amazon.com and just find a different band to like <laughs> <laughs> well there is that there is the world wide web which offers many jane's uh, addiction's really good they haven't put out an album in a while but jeez uh, no, you, you actually you can find both of our, I believe, albums on Amazon.com and at CD Baby, and we have and iTunes on iTunes. Uh, we uh, are working on a new website to replace our rickety old one, which mm. uh, recently the internet upgraded and it shut ours down because it's so bloody old. So we have a new <laughs> one, new one in the process, but it'll still be at CrunchyWesternBoys.com. We are Excellent. available on the Facebooks. Um, we we've been talking about this, but maybe if I say it on here, we'll actually start posting a few. We're going to do a, a podcast soon, Morris and I. You are, yeah, we are, and it's going to be Morris and I. <laughs> That's what it's going to be called. Nope, I don't oh. know what it's going to be called, and I'm not sure what we're going to talk about. We're just going to be Morris and I on on. Uh, it's going to be more of our witty banter. It is really, it is, yeah. yeah. Except with the expletives. And you can be our guest. I would love that. I yeah. Love to. We'll yes. interview you. Well, let's try it now. So, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Morris. Thank you for having me. So, tell us about your childhood. <laughs> uh, it was rough. <laughs> what was your dad like? He beat the sh- uh, he beat the hell out of me. Hey, wait. Wait a minute. That's was his my name Jay McBride? <laughs> yes. And your story. Oh, my God. Our dads are all the same guy. Yeah. Yeah. It's weird, huh? So, so we're like Steve, Matt was brothers. born at a very young age. He was born at a very young in age. In a cabin he built with his own hands. With his own two hands. And that's the, all the background I have on him so far. But Actually, I was born in a crossfire hurricane, but it's all right now. It is all right it now. Is. It, in fact, it's a gas. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> So what do you guys want to play to wrap up the show? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, we're like going to play do, uh, the first three uh, 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 Black Sabbath albums in their entirety <laughs> in order. And um, you should hear Morris' Ozzy. It's, it's, stunning. it's yeah, stunning. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, it's All stunning. Right. He's got to just do a little cocaine first. Uh, okay? <laughs> Better? Yeah. yeah, and I'll be right back. <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh-huh. Right. Rather than Shall hear I? my Ozzy, you should really see it. And to really get the full effect, right? Yeah, right. My Ozzy. He's, he looks like Ozzy, yeah. but he sounds like uh, Lemmy. Um, <laughs> the 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 last song is what was the last? Uh, uh, we're gonna do a long drive home. Here's a song for the Ooh. the musicians out there and the people waiting for them to show up uh, or to leave or to leave. <laughs> yeah, either <laughs> one. And also, there's a little line in there for the uh, the. Club owners who disappear at the end of the night when you're looking to get paid. Ah, and, and, yes. And the ladies too. There's there's a nice shout out to the to the to yes. the women who put up with our our. Uh, and who deserve most credit anyway? Yeah. Oh yeah, because you know the old joke. You know what do you call a musician without a girlfriend? What? Homeless. Ah, yes. I hadn't heard that joke. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's not a joke. It's not a joke, man. It's real. We're, we're going to go back to our car slash condo. And, uh, <laughs> and, uh, anyway. I get the cardboard tonight. You know, two crunchy Western boys walk past a bar. <laughs> it could, it could happen. happen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> walk past a bar or into a bar? Uh, no, past a bar. Past a bar. Yeah, it yeah. could happen. Okay. It could happen. All right. So it's called Long Drive Home? It is. All right. Here are the country west. Uh, cr- ah, yeah, you did it again. Ah, here are the crunchy western boys. <sighs>
performing Long Drive Home here on Local Outbreak. Thanks, guys. Somebody's chasing someone For some money that we rode It's a lonely Long drive home Welcome to the world of the music made You play cause you got to You play cause you can It's with it hits the vinyl It's where the rubber meets the road It's a lonely Long drive home You know we've made a million miles or more Just to sing for you these songs It's a lonely Long drive home Still the magic always happens When you good folks sing along It's a lonely Long drive home Welcome to the world of the music made You sing cause you got to You sing cause you can where the needle hits the vinyl It's where the rubber meets the road It's a lonely long drive home Gotta have a heart like Mary's To stand behind this life I choose It's a lonely Long drive home Yeah, but she's my destination I tell ya, man, she's my main muse It's a lonely Long drive home Welcome to the world of the music made You play cause you got to You play cause you can It's where the needle hits the vinyl It's where the rubber meets the road It's a lonely Long drive home it's a lonely, long drive home. It's a lonely, long drive home. That was a C major 6-9 for those playing the home game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> IPMNation.com